The introduction of Buick Terraza is important for Buick dealers as Buick continues to update and diversify its portfolio. Buick's entry into the medium van segment is news, and the vehicle itself, it's truly a magnificent machine. Terraza is unique in this market segment because it combines attributes of medium vans and sport utility vehicles into a premium crossover sport van. Its aggressive look and high level of standard and optional features set it apart from the competition as well as other GM medium vans. During this video, we'll review key product features of the Terraza like quiet tuning, the innovative overhead rail system, available all-wheel drive, flip-down convenience trays, a standard rear DVD entertainment system, rear cargo convenience center, automatic leveling rear suspension, as well as the 3.5 liter V6 engine. These features, as well as a variety of others, are items you can use to give you the advantage with customers who are shopping the competition. Speaking of the competition, during this presentation, we'll compare the Terraza CXL all-wheel drive to the Chrysler Town & Country Touring Model. We've organized this video into segments that correspond with the way customers are motivated to buy. These five keys to learning will help you create an effective walk-around presentation and will guide you through certification. We'll compare comfort and convenience, power and performance, ride and handling, quality, reliability, durability, and safety and security. We'll also use this icon to highlight Terraza's advantages for 2005. The Buick emphasis in the medium van segment is to provide a fusion of Buick sedan values with truck-like utility. Therefore, both Terraza trim levels, the CX and CXL, are available in front-wheel drive or all-wheel drive. It's important to note that both models are exceptionally well equipped, with the CXL having a higher level of luxury and amenities than the CX. Standard features on the CXL include leather-appointed seats, overhead rail storage system with rear DVD entertainment system, eight-way power adjustable seats for the driver and front passenger, dual power sliding doors, quiet tuning, traction control, ultrasonic rear parking assist, dual zone front climate controls and rear seat climate controls, dual stage frontal airbags and seat mounted side impact airbags, steering wheel mounted audio controls, two extra storage consoles for the overhead rail system, two pair of infrared wireless headphones, cargo convenience center, auxiliary 115 volt power outlet, brushed aluminum luggage rails, 17 inch aluminum 10 spoke wheels, flat folding third row seat, eight speaker sound system with CD player MP3 playback, automatic level control, ABS, DIC, and more. The competitor, as previously stated, is the touring edition of the Chrysler Town & Country. It's only available in front-wheel drive. All-wheel drive was discontinued for 2005. More on that later. The Town & Country comes in four different models, Base, LX, Touring, and Limited. The Base model is a short wheelbase version, 113.1 inches. The LX, Touring, and Limited all have a longer wheelbase of 119.3 inches. Before we take a look at the standard features on the Town & Country, let's take a look at its changes for the 2005 model year. There are redesigns of the front fascia and grille, as well as the body cladding that's optional on the Touring model. There are redesigned headlamps for the long wheelbase versions of the Town & Country. Those are the LX, Touring, and Limited models. A stainless steel roof rack replaces the body color roof rack on the limited model and an integrated rear park assist system has been introduced as optional on the touring model. But the most significant change is a new seating system called Stow and Go. It allows the second and third row seats to fold into the floor, leaving a flat load floor surface. However, this flexibility comes with some drawbacks as you'll see later in this video. The touring model which we'll examine today, is near the top of the town and country lineup with standard features that include cloth seating surfaces, three-zone manual air conditioning, 
satin silver center stack, overhead console, driver and passenger side power sliding doors and power lift gate, eight-way power driver seat, steering wheel audio controls, leather wrap steering wheel, stow and go seating system, black roof rack and low speed traction control. A very popular option on the Touring model is the Luxury Group. It includes three zone automatic temperature control, removable console between the front seats, overhead console with rail system and three removable storage modules, trip computer with vehicle information system, security alarm, rear park assist, automatic rear view mirror, electro luminescent instrument cluster, fog lamps, body color body side cladding, chrome exterior accents, infinity speaker system, and power adjustable pedals. As you'll see throughout this presentation, when comparably equipped, the Terraza is a better value than the Chrysler Town & Country. The Town & Country and Terraza are similar in size, with Terraza having the longer wheelbase for a smooth ride. One thing that is noticeable, especially when taking a look at the vehicles from the front, is that while Town & Country retains the traditional minivan look, Terraza has a more aggressive appearance with SUV-like styling cues. The exposed C-pillars are wide and prominent, and the hood is higher and more powerful looking. The up-level roof rack is large and has a rugged look, and the front and rear fascias have a skid plate effect. Terraza is definitely not a minivan. On the exterior, aside from the minivan look, Town & Country is only equipped with 16-inch wheels compared to the larger 17-inch wheels used on Terraza for a more aggressive road stance. Now let's turn our attention to the hallmark of vehicles in this segment, passenger and cargo carrying capacity and versatility. In terms of maximum cargo space, Town & Country has a significant advantage. With all of the stow-and-go seats folded into the floor, Town & Country has over 160 cubic feet of space, compared to Terraza's 136.5 cubic feet, with its second and third rows removed. However, it is important to compare cargo capacities under more common situations. When carrying four occupants as well as cargo, Terraza's space behind the second row is actually much larger than Town & Country. 74 cubic feet compared to 54.9 cubic feet. In the real world, this will be a more common day-to-day -day seating configuration. And with all three rows of seats in position for seven passengers, Terraza and Town & Country have nearly identical cargo capacity behind the rear seats. Chrysler is touting their stow-and-go seats as a major advantage, which allows the second and third rows to be folded flat into the floor. But here too, it is important to look at the real-world use of this system and recognize its limitations. First of all, when it comes time to fold the seats, anything being stored in the floor wells must be removed before the seats are stowed. This can be a real inconvenience for customers. Secondly, in designing the stow and go seats, Chrysler was forced to make some significant compromises. In order to make room for the seat wells, the availability of an all-wheel drive had to be sacrificed on town and country. Plus, the seats are thinner than usual, making them less comfortable. And finally, the fuel tank had to remain at 20 gallons this year, whereas Terraza was designed with a much larger 25-gallon tank for fewer fill-ups. In comparison, Terraza provides similar seating flexibility but without sacrificing comfort, all-wheel drive, and convenience. All of Terraza's CXL seating surfaces are fully trimmed in premium nuanced sandstone leather. The Town & Country Touring seating surfaces come standard in Vegas cloth and are available in leather. Terraza's innovative rear cargo convenience center creates a flat load floor when the third row seats are folded and any items in the convenience center do not have to be removed. Inside, dividers create four separate storage compartments, ideally sized for a variety of common items. Town & Country simply has a hole in the floor that the seat folds into with some bag holders. For additional flexibility, the second row seat backs can be folded forward Plus, both the second and third row seats can be removed altogether, something not possible on Town & Country. Terraza also offers several other unique storage features. The first and second row captain's chairs come with standard fold-down convenience trays that makes access to the rear easier. 
Though Town & Country has a removable second row console, it cannot be lowered into the stow and go seat wells and must be stored when removed. Convenient storage compartments are located on the back of all four Terrazas captain's chairs, featuring open as well as covered compartments. Town & Country only has a simple cloth pouch on the back of the front passenger seat. Also standard on Terraza is an overhead rail storage system that feature a combination of fixed modules and reconfigurable snap-in storage modules. A similar system costs extra on Town & Country touring. To many potential buyers, the audio system is an extremely important area of consideration. The standard audio systems on the Terraza features AM, FM, CD, and MP3 capabilities with eight premium speakers. The eight-speaker premium sound system is an option on the Town & Country Touring model and it does not have MP3 capability. Here are some more facts about the Town & Country Touring model. XM satellite radio is not available. It is on the Terraza. The rear seat entertainment system featuring a DVD player is standard on all Terrazas. It's an added cost option on the Town & Country Touring. Terraza's mobile digital media system by Fat Noise, featuring a 40 gigabyte hard drive that supports audio as well as video is a mid-year available feature on the Terraza. Town & Country has no feature along these lines. However, the Town & Country does offer a 6-disc CD DVD changer as an option. Other features such as an in-dash 6-disc CD changer and DVD-based navigation system are available on both vehicles. The Homelink Universal Transmitter is standard on both. One thing that the Town & Country offers that is not available on the Terraza is an available power moonroof. However, this feature deletes the overhead console with the rail system as well as the supplemental side curtain airbags. Both Terraza and Town & Country Touring feature a climate control system that allows individual temperature control for the driver, front seat passenger, and rear passenger area of the vehicle. Automatic climate control is an option on Town & Country Touring, though not on Terraza. But Terraza offers an available factory installed remote vehicle starter system, which is not available on any Town & Country. This convenience feature is especially handy in warm or cold climates, since the remote starter also activates the climate controls, allowing you to cool down the interior or warm it up before getting inside. The final point to discuss in the comfort and convenience section is Terraza's use of quiet tuning technology. Quiet tuning is a three-step total vehicle approach to noise and vibration reduction. Engineers have incorporated numerous noise and vibration sound reducing measures throughout Terraza to achieve impressive interior quietness and help make the driving experience more enjoyable. Town & Country uses sound deadening quiet steel, but only in the floor. Both the Terraza and the Town & Country Touring models are equipped with six-cylinder engines as standard equipment. The Town & Country's is a 3.8-liter V6, and the Terraza displaces 3.5 liters. Power ratings on the Town & Country Touring model are 215 horsepower at 5,000 RPM and 245 pound-feet of torque at 4,000 RPM. Figures for the Terraza are 200 horsepower at 5,200 RPM and 220 pound-feet of torque Although the Town & Country has a small horsepower and torque advantage, the Terraza offers a more advanced design with features like electronic throttle control versus the Town & Country's outdated cable-operated fuel control. Our advantage is that there is virtually no throttle lag over the entire driving range, providing better feel and exceptional fuel efficiency. Also, Terraza's advanced design allows it to reach the EPA's ultra-low emissions vehicle rating Town & Country only achieves a low emission vehicle designation. EPA estimated fuel economy on the Town & Country is 18 miles per gallon in the city and 25 on the highway. This is roughly equivalent to Terraza's 17 miles per gallon city and 24 on the highway for the front wheel drive version and a rating of 17 and 22 for the all wheel drive version. The fuel economies are close, but take a look at the cruising ranges. With a fuel tank size of only 20 gallons, the maximum range of the town and country is only 500 miles. For the front-wheel drive Terraza with its 25-gallon tank, the range is 600 miles. 
the all-wheel drive version of Terraza also beats the town and country, coming in at 550 miles. The final point on power and performance is trailer towing. Both vehicles can be equipped to tow trailers. Town & Country leads the class with a maximum rating of 3,800 pounds, but Terraza comes in at a very respectable 3,500 pounds max tow rating. When it comes to ride and handling, the Terraza has a smooth and responsive four-wheel independent suspension. Up front is a McPherson strut type suspension. At the rear is a coil spring equipped short long arm type. The town and country also features a McPherson strut type front suspension. But at the rear is a semi-independent beam axle type rear suspension with leaf springs. This type of suspension is not nearly as refined as Terraza's short long arm. The Town & Country's rear suspension reacts to bumps and road imperfections on both sides of the vehicle because the wheels are attached via an axle assembly. Terraza's wheels, on the other hand, react independently, resulting in a smoother and more comfortable ride as well as more stable handling, especially over uneven surfaces. In addition to the overall suspension design, there are quite a number of Terraza handling advantages over the Town & Country. First, Note that there is no all-wheel drive option available on the town and country. As mentioned earlier, this had to be eliminated because the components used on the 2004 model were not compatible with the new stow-and-go seating in the 2005. Next, there is no optional item on the town and country like Terraza's available Stabilitrack Advanced Vehicle Stability Enhancement System. Stabilitrack helps the driver keep control of the vehicle during evasive maneuvers and driving situations at all speeds. This advanced design feature that's available on front-wheel drive models works in tandem with ABS and traction control to automatically correct oversteer or understeer conditions and keep the vehicle traveling in the desired direction. In terms of braking, both vehicles are equipped with four-wheel disc brakes and anti-lock brakes as standard equipment. A final point on traction control. It's standard on the town and country, but this is a low-speed system that is only operational below 35 miles per hour. And this system only functions with the ABS system. That means no automatic throttle control during traction control operation. Terraza, on the other hand, offers standard all-speed traction control and available Stabilitrack on front-wheel drive models or all-wheel drive. Both Terraza and Town & Country are feature vehicles in the medium van market for their respective nameplates. Terraza delivers with exceptional ride qualities, sedan level amenities, along with innovative passenger and cargo carrying capabilities. And when it comes to quality, reliability and durability, there is a difference here as well. The maximum oil change interval on Terraza is 10,000 miles. It's only 7,500 miles for the Town & Country. Buick is able to set this standard because the oil life system technology of the Terraza. The transmission fluid change interval on the Terraza is 100,000 miles. Transmission fluid changes on the town and country are recommended every 40,000 miles. And how about engine coolant? Our change interval with DexCool is and has been for several years, five years or 150,000 miles. The interval for the town and country is five years or 100,000 miles we have a significant mileage advantage. It's facts like these that you can use to sell the obvious advantages that Terraza has in cost of ownership. Warranty is, of course, an important issue. Both Terraza and Town & Country have a bumper-to-bumper -bumper warranty for three years or 36,000 miles. We also have this same coverage for the powertrain. However, the Chrysler powertrain warranty is seven years or 70,000 miles. For rust-through protection, Terraza has the edge with six years or 100,000 miles, while Town & Country offers five years with 100,000 miles. And when the unexpected happens, help isn't far away, as the manufacturers of both vehicles offer roadside assistance 24-7 at any time during the first three years or 36,000 miles of the warranty period. Both vehicles offer good warranties, with a slight advantage to the town and country in the powertrain area, and a slight advantage to Terraza in rust-through coverage. But the point you should really remember from this section 
is Terraza's low cost of ownership due to longer service intervals. A final factor to discuss in this segment is Terraza's quiet tuning. This is a Buick exclusive and must be communicated to any customer looking at a Terraza. This feature significantly reduces passenger compartment noise and contributes to the extremely comfortable driving environment, which is sure to be a trademark of Terraza. Town and country is no match, so be sure to point out quiet tuning during a test drive. Looking at safety and security, both Terraza and Town & Country offer an impressive list of standard and optional features. Standard occupant protection features include front and rear crush zones, safety cage construction, and side door beams. Both Terraza CXL and Town & Country Touring have multi-stage driver and front passenger frontal airbags. But Town & Country does not have an available driver and front passenger seat-mounted side impact airbag system. Both vehicles are equipped with a front airbag passenger sensing system. It's designed to automatically turn off the frontal passenger airbag in the event the seat is empty or the seat occupant is below the threshold value for weight, indicating a small adult. On both vehicles, a monitoring indicator informs the driver of the passenger side airbag status. It's important to note that even with the passenger sensing system, children should ride properly restrained in the rear seat Supplemental side curtain airbags for all three rows are an option on the touring model of the town and country. Though side curtain airbags are not offered on Terraza, you can counter this by reinforcing Terraza's broad approach to safety and security. First, considerable attention and investment has been put into Terraza's structure to achieve the highest possible government crash test ratings. Terraza also provides excellent handling for accident avoidance with all speed traction control available Stabilitrack and available all-wheel drive, as well as a four-wheel independent suspension. None of these features is available on Town & Country. Terraza also includes OnStar with a one-year safe and sound package, which will automatically notify authorities if an accident occurs and the airbags are deployed. This is not available on any other competitor. And a point about airbags and child safety. Remind your customers to always use safety belts and proper child restraints, even with airbags. Children are safer when properly secured in the rear seat. Never place a rear-facing infant restraint in the front seat of any vehicle equipped with an active frontal airbag. Both Terraza and Town & Country have latch equipment on the second row seats and on the center seat position of the third row. Continuing on, daytime running lamps and automatic lamp control are standard on Terraza. Town & Country does not have the DRL feature, but it does have automatic lamp control. When it comes to fog lamps, they are not available on Terraza. However, they are available on Town & Country. So what's the bottom line? How do the 2005 Terraza CXL with all-wheel drive and the Town & Country Touring compare? The Town & Country is a very good competitor, but Terraza is the vehicle of choice. Let's look at the facts. In terms of comfort and convenience, both vehicles provide an exceptionally comfortable environment. Terraza comes out ahead with its standard leather seating surfaces, 17-inch wheels, and distinctive SUV styling compared to the Town & Country's cloth seating services, 16-inch wheels, and minivan appearance. Also, there are far more entertainment features on the Terraza, especially the availability of XM satellite radio, MP3 capabilities, and mobile digital media system by Fat Noise, along with the standard rear seat DVD entertainment system. The major point of excitement on the Town & Country is the stow and go seating. With that in mind, Remember the inconvenience of emptying seat wells and the less comfortable second and third row seats. In addition, Terraza offers many unique storage features including an innovative rear cargo convenience center. Chrysler will tout their overhead rail system, but Terraza has one too, with the standard DVD system. When comparing power and performance, the 3.5 liter engine of the Terraza has to go up against the more powerful 3.8 liter engine of the town and country. Keep in mind that the Terraza's engine is more refined, 
using modern technologies like electronic throttle control for exceptional throttle feel and smooth acceleration. Also, both vehicles have similar fuel economy ratings. But, because it has a 25-gallon fuel tank, Terraza has significantly greater range versus Town & Country's 20-gallon tank capacity. A final point, Town & Country's greater power output and more primitive engine design have emissions trade-offs. The Terraza is able to achieve an ultra-low emission vehicle rating as opposed to the Town & Country's low emission rating. For ride and handling, the major point is that there is no all-wheel drive available on the Town & Country. Also, the suspension system is not as refined as on the Terraza. Theirs is an independent front suspension with a semi-independent rear suspension. Terraza has full four-wheel independent suspension which results in a smoother ride and improved handling. Also, Terraza includes a rear load leveling suspension as standard equipment. It's only available with a trailer towing package on the town and country. Turning to quality, reliability and durability, Terraza's quiet tuning provides a quieter cabin environment. And Terraza has lower maintenance costs due to longer service intervals. In safety and security, look to Terraza advantages when it comes to driver and passenger seat mounted side airbags daytime running lamps, and the availability of OnStar, items not found on the town and country. In every area, Terraza is one better than the competition. Be sure and visit www.buick.com and www.lacrosse-terrazalaunch.com for the latest information on Buick Terraza. <laughs>